So now that we have our strap, we're gonna slowly lower all the way down to our back again. So nice flat spine. Extend the legs out long. Feel that engagement. Point the toes actively away from you and then slowly release the heels so that the toes are pointing up towards the sky. Feel the difference between the two activities. Flex through the left heel as you lift the right leg up. Find your strap. Some of you will be able to find the bind with the peace fingers on the big toes. But wherever you are, flex through both heels. Breathe. We did a lot of leg work in our previous video. So just working out, lengthening, releasing, three, maybe you inch those toes just a little bit closer to the space above your head, four, make sure the left leg is active, five, six, seven, eight. Go ahead and begin to release that right leg down over to the right. Flex through the heel. If it feels good to you, go ahead and tee out that left arm and take the gaze over the left shoulder. If you're noticing that the left hip is starting to lift up, go ahead and mindfully press that hip down towards the floor. Allow that leg to open up, breathe. So if the straight leg is a little too much, go ahead and bend that leg, that's okay. Modify, go ahead and Mac MacGyver up your practice. Three, four, five, six, seven, Eight. Inhale back to center. Now readjust. If you have the bind with the peace fingers, you may want to take the left hand to that bind or take your strap over to the left and allow that right leg to reach for the ground on the left side. Once again, modify if you need to. Bend that leg. If you find that there's a crinkle happening between your brow, you're in a little too tight. Ease up on yourself. Tee out that arm if it feels good and take the gaze over the right hand. Breathe. Embrace this twist. Flex through that left heel. Breathe. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven and eight. Inhale back into center. Go ahead and pull that knee in towards the chest. Go ahead and give it a little swirl. And here's the important part. Go ahead and drop into that supine tree, right? Supine tree. If the knee is floating, go ahead and stick a block under it. And we're going to come back to that hand bind again that we did earlier. So if you watch Napoleon Dynamite, go ahead and make those fluttery hands. If you make shadow puppets for your kids, go ahead and make the bird symbol. But activate through the interlocked thumbs and send it into the soft space above this breastbone and then spread the fingers wide. Follow the breath in as you send relaxation through the body. Breathe. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Go ahead and send the leg down to meet the left one. Release the hands down onto the mat and take a moment here to observe the difference between the two sides. All right, so make sure you do that same stretch. On the other side, we wanna stay balanced 
and then come into your own closing procedures. So you can, you know, come into that crisscross applesauce that, uh, you know, feels so good. You can come into a full lotus if you'd like, right leg first, left leg on top. If you have the bind in your lotus, feel free to go ahead and reach around for opposite toes. I don't have that. Um, I'm working on it, but you know, someday. So find an easy seat that works for you. And instead of releasing the palms down onto the knees, once again, I'd like to come back to that interlaced hand movement. So a lot of people have said that they miss the shoulder press. And this is my best form of what a shoulder press would feel like. So go ahead and find your five big breaths to close your practice. So inhale, exhale three, four, five. Lengthen your spine, inhale, two, three, four, five. Lengthen the spine, inhale, exhale, one, two, three, four, five. Two more breaths, just like that. Long exhales. Relax the mind. Relax the mind. Relax the mind. It's been my honor to guide you through your practice, even if it was staggered. So feel free to put your own practice together, blend things that you like, take out things that you don't like, but keep moving, keep practicing, and keep breathing. All right, miss you all. Don't forget the Napoleon Dynamite bird. It really does send good vibes. All right, peace out. Nope, wrong.